the Isabella State University was established through Presidential Decree 1434 by the then President Ferdinand Marcos on June 10, 1978. From the year of its establishment to year 1995, the then Rojas Memorial Agricultural and Industrial School, Armais, now ISU Rojas Campus, was geared at Barangay Matusalem. In the same year, Honorable Faustino S. T. Jr., Isabella's second district representative, now fifth district, donated a two hectares of land located at Barangay Rangayan, Ross Isabella, where ISU initially established its operation. On April 14, 2000, the ISU Board of Regents approved the integration of Armais to ISU system in pursuance to Republic Act 7722-8292 and Commission on Higher Education Memorandum Order No. 18, Series of 1999. Thus, effective this first semester of school year 2000-2001, the academic program of Armais were integrated to Isabella State University Rojas Campus except its financial appropriation. On January 1, 2002, Armais was fully integrated to Isabella State University Rojas Campus. The campus has a total land area of 144 hectares and has three sites strategically located in the municipality of Rojas. East side at Barangay Rangayan, mid and west side at Barangay Matusalem. To our desire to sustain quality and excellence, Isabella State University Rojas Campus adheres to its quality policy. As a result, the campus is now ISO 9001-2015 certified. Furthermore, the Commission on Higher Education Region 2 recognized the campus on its effort in sustaining quality and excellence through accreditation and identified a Center for Provincial Institute of Fisheries Education. The Office of the Provincial Governor of Isabella recognized also ISU Rojas for establishing viable and exceptional cultural program. Isabella State University Rojas Campus remained steadfast amid pandemic in sustaining and maintaining quality education through its excellent instruction, research, extension, and good governance. It continues to improve while persistently enhancing facilities, instructional materials, and learning resources. Faculty and staff development is continuously supported to keep them abreast with current breakthroughs in their respective fields. The campus remains committed in fulfilling the delivery of services to meet the needs of its clientele. In the research development and extension and community involvement, the institution employs a scheme which are designed to benefit different communities which include training, workshops, and extension activities. Infrastructure has been boosted by the campus through the support of the national government and other funding agencies. Some infrastructure projects were completed such as the Fisheries Aquaculture Laboratory, four classrooms for fisheries academic building, two academic model classrooms, two-story academic building with eight classrooms and mini theater. Relatively, the renovation of gymnasium and library are ongoing. These projects demonstrate the consistent pursuit in improving efficiency of learning and enhancing access to quality education. The campus is offering courses which are considered identified and priority programs under the Commission on Higher Education and Regional Development Center Resolution, namely, Bachelor of Secondary Education, Majors in Mathematics and Filipino. Bachelor of Science in Fisheries and Aquatic Sciences. Bachelor of Science in Criminology. Bachelor of Science in Information Technology. Bachelor of Science in Agriculture, Majors in Organic Agriculture, Animal Science, 
and entomology. Bachelor of Science in Agribusiness major in Agribusiness Management. Bachelor of Science in Law Enforcement Administration. To be offered this first semester school year 2021-2022. In terms of enrollment, ISU Rojas continuously grow as its enrollment remarkably increase every school year. The COVID-19 pandemic and challenge of online learning did not even hinder students to choose the campus as their home for academic and skills development. All the six undergraduate programs offered in the campus are accredited by the accrediting agency for chartered colleges and universities in the Philippines and granted with certification of program compliance from the Commission on Higher Education. The performance of the graduates in the licensure examination result may not be notably higher than the national passing rate, but at least equal or slightly higher in some cases. It is also noted that there are graduates, particularly in Bachelor of Secondary Education program, who bag as regional top-notchers in the board licensure examination for professional teachers. The Isabella State University Rojas Campus, under the Office of Student Services, has established student development programs. The programs include students' activities and participations in various levels, both in internal and external arena. Moreover, the programs aim to further develop the students' knowledge, skills, and attitude. The highlight of the student development program is the system of accreditation. Reaccreditation, monitoring, and evaluation using participatory institutional procedures and processes in recognition of the basic right to organize. In addition, the campus ensures that the leadership training programs are provided. Furthermore, the campus conducts regular comprehensive orientation program for new and continuing students in response to students' needs. Scholarships and financial assistance in various forms are also available to students. The Campus Research and Development Unit made a laudable accomplishment. Its mandate on generating technologies to be commercialized and be extended to the community had been successfully realized. Through the joint efforts and endeavors of the campus, Different industries, be it government organization, non-government organization, and private sectors. The provision of the 3M dairy equipment from the Department of Trade and Industry marks the greatest accomplishment in the field of research, for it resulted the establishment of dairy processing center of the campus. Dairy product development such as processing flavored ice cream, featuring the One Campus, One Product. In pursuit of excellence, the extension and training services continuously questing of ways to help the community, especially those unable to work because of pandemic, like training for the Saplot Armais industry at ISU Matusalem Campus. As fruit of dedication, the campus was awarded a Certificate of Recognition in Sustainable Livelihood Program by the Department of Social Welfare and Development, Regional Office No. 2. The campus vigorously generates income from various enterprises. The objectives of the Office of the Campus Business Affair, Responsible, Accountable, and Rewarding Business, were strictly observed through the cooperation of the stakeholders. ISU Rojas generates income from agriculture-based enterprises such as rice production, mango production, tilapia production, swine production, goat and sheep production, poultry production, vermicast production, and seedling production. Recently, the campus established the Sibao store that can sell turmeric eggs, vegetables, meat products, dairy products, and PE uniform, and other generated income such as farm machinery rental, land rental, 
canteen rental, cottage or dorm rental, ID fabrication, and internet services. The campus granted by Department of Agriculture of a windmill and solar pump to irrigate its agricultural land area. The university remains committed in fulfilling its mandates to serve and ensure that the delivery of its services, facilities, implementation of its projects, programs, and activities to meet the needs of its clientele. The said endeavor made possible through its commitment to the general principle of efficiency on operations, effectiveness, and maintaining high standards of professionalism. The provision of opportunities for enhancing the competencies, knowledge, skills, and expertise of faculty and staff through advanced studies or trainings is continuing program and concern of the university. Consequently, faculty and staff shall embody the appropriate standard of promoting the mission and vision of the university and possibly made it tangible to the members of ISU family. Provision of physical resources and facilities needed to maintain excellence and provide enhanced opportunities to faculty, staff, and students are major concerns of the university. As such, the campus continues to exert effort in upgrading its facilities through prudent but aggressive fund sourcing. <music>